Hi guys, it's Marky. How's it going, everybody? Today I'm showcasing a bunch of Hot Wheels from my Cardic collection. We'll take a closer look at all of these and I'm gonna show you now. Just gonna go one by one so you have an idea of what we're gonna be looking at. And we'll check out all these a little bit closer and see what they look like. Even though they're on the card, you can still see them and see some of the details. And we'll check this one out. And this one. And this one. And this one. And one more. And here we go. Let's start with this one right here. So here we have a beautiful 76 Greenwood Corvette. Here's the card. A really nice card. And I love the red, white, and blue. It looks so cool. A really beautiful Hot Wheels. Go ahead and get close up and see how he looks. We have the Chevrolet name right there on the front fender with a Chevrolet badge, a number 76 on the door. And we have the Michelin man all the way back here. Check out the red chrome stripe on the blacked out wheels. Looks really, really cool. Now, instead of red, white, and blue, they went with red, silver, and blue on the, on the stripes on the side there. Same thing on the hood. We have the red, silver, and the blue in the middle, and then some blue stripes towards the edges. The big number 76 in the corner there. And we do have some blue tint on the glass that's covering the lights there. Blue tint on the on all the glass everywhere all around. All the windows are rolled up, or both windows are rolled up on the sides. We do have the exhaust showing towards the back of the door there. Oh, I should say right in the middle of the door. The exhaust right there. Made in Malaysia. Hot Wheels logo right there. And no name for the car on this one. Copyright 2012 Mattel. The 76 Greenwood Corvette. And he's sporting that 76. Hot Wheels logo on that red area there with the blue. On the back end, look at that. Wow. <laughs> Check that out on the sides there amazing and no extra colors for the lights no extra colors or numbers for the license plate all white in the back all whited out we do have a little grill showing through there part of the base you can see how it goes in there and then it you can see it right there very very nice a beautiful green wood in red white blue and silver <laughs> a really really nice card I love the red chrome on the on the blacked out wheels. That looks pretty cool. The base is all plastic. The top of the car, of course, the body is all metal. And you can see the exhaust is plastic showing on the sides there. And you can see that right there. Very, very nice. A beautiful car, by the way. Beautiful. Really nice. The graphics on the car look awesome as well. We do have some black there and black towards the middle. And there you see the covers for the lights. They did a good job on these. I like how they look and they have that blue clear plastic. We're just missing those little uh, black towards the corners, the little uh, vents on the sides there. Should have had a little bit of black there and over there. Very, very nice. They don't even show mirrors on the side of this uh, Greenwood on the graphics and there are no mirrors here neither on the actual car. And no windshield wipers. And the stripes kind of end right here. I wish they would go all over towards the back, but they don't. Nothing on the hood, I mean on the uh, on the roof, and nothing on the trunk or the back there. But a beautiful car, 4 of 10 in the Hot Wheels Race Day Series. Really nice, number 34 of 250. Beautiful car. And let's check, check out another one, another beauty. Let's move these packs over here. A Porsche 918 Spider in blue with the white stripes on the on the hood there. Front end. Beautiful white wheels on this one. Look at that. All, all painted over in blue on the back end. No extra colors. No extra colors whatsoever. We do have the little Hot Wheels logo back here. 
And a little something going on here with black and silver. Some details. A smoked, smoky colored uh, windshield. There are no wipers on there. And no sun visors, no rear, rear view mirror, no side view mirrors. Just a left side driver over there with a steering wheel on the left. And we do have a really nice dashboard with console heading down, door, down the middle there, which looks really nice. Some pretty cool details in there. Nice big tall bucket seats. And check out the back, how they have that protection there. Diecast comes all the way up there. So this must be the, uh, I guess, I don't know. Could that be part of that? The cover, does it come up? I don't know. Gonna have to find out. They do show mirrors on the graphics here for the car, but there are no mirrors there. They are in blue. There are no mirrors on the car. Nice uh, white stripes. We have four stripes there on the middle with the Porsche, I mean the uh, the badge, yeah, the Porsche spider badge. And we do have the beautiful lights with a lot of detail. Look really cool. And he's trapped in this bubble. Yeah, this is one of those that I wanted to collect uh, carded. Just wanted to keep him in the on the card. I don't know why. 505 from the Porsche series. A really cool series where we got five Porsches that year. Don't remember what year this is from. And the copyrights don't always match the year, so I'm not sure. I gotta check that out. And I have this black Shelby Cobra with red stripes, red interior, chrome base, chrome pipes showing here on the side. Chrome stripe around the wheel, which is a blacked out five spoke rim. And we can see on the back, mostly black, but we do have the red stripes coming down towards the bottom there. And right before the license plate, they stop. No extra color for the brakes. No colors on the license plate. We do have a chrome floorboard showing right under the steering wheel there and a red one on this side. Here we have the grill showing through. It's a uh, plastic chrome. And these things down here, I don't know what those are. Could those be some extra lights or something? Not even sure. Shelby Cobra. 427 SC. And that's what it says here too. Shelby Cobra 427 SC. Really nice with the red stripes, and then it has a little gray stripe. You can hardly see it, but there's a gray stripe goes over these vents here on the side. And heads towards the towards the door and all the way back to the back of the door there. Hot Wheels logo in gray. Beautiful Cobra. Here's the graphics on the card. We do have a little damage on this card. And I remember the day I found this one on the pegs. There was no other, so I couldn't get another one and switch it out so i just took what they had <clears throat> four of five in this uh roadsters series pretty cool number 191 of 250 that might help us uh, find out what year this is from beautiful beautiful cobra and here's a red edition you know what red edition means that means it's only sold at target it's a target exclusive Red Edition Series, 11 of 12 cars that you could find. One for each month of the year at Target. Don't remember what year this one is from, but I collected this one a while back. And it's a Sand Blaster. In a Red Edition color. It has the Borla treatment with the lightning bolt. <coughs> More lightning bolts on the front, excuse me. And we do have... Some vents there on the hood, a couple vents towards the back of the hood, Borla name right on front, lights and a grill, big rugged tires on this one. Made in Malaysia, copyright 2013 for the Sand Blaster. And there's the, car, uh, the card, the graphics on the card. See the light bar on top, that big bumper in the front sticks out and those extra lights on the front there and then the ones on the back are just painted over in red but they should have been kind of like this a really cool hot wheels though there it is the sand blaster only two doors on this vehicle left side driver 
We do have all this die cast reinforcement back here. Protection. And a big piece of metal back here. Right there. The base is all plastic. Made in Malaysia. A very cool red edition. And this one will say that you did find... Congratulations, you just scored a Target only exclusive vehicle. Collect all 12, find them throughout the year. Only at Target, Target stores. Copyright 2017 on here. <clears throat> Not sure what year this one came out. But it's a pretty cool, <clears throat> pretty cool Hot Wheels. And then we have a 2016 Lamborghini. <clears throat> Another Roadster. <clears throat> Excuse me, Roadster series. This one's white. Beautiful Centenario in white. Lamborghini name there. And the brake lights in red. Some detail for exhaust there right in the middle. You can see the engine back here. The little area we can see through a little bit. The uh, glass is kind of smoky, so it's hard to see through it. Beautiful bucket seats on this one. Wow, really cool details. And this one's a beauty. I do have this one loose in other colors. I don't remember if I have a white one loose, but I did, I did find uh, this one that I have in my card collection. Black fives, folks. They look really good with those lower profile tires. Really, really nice. And check out the front end. Beautiful lights, nice badge, Lamborghini badge. Red spoiler, all white grill, white vents on the hood. Or the front area. Very cool. Very nice. Handles on the doors. The glass is rolled up. You can see that. Wow, what a beauty. A really nice Hot Wheels. Check out that console in the middle with all the little details, little buttons and whatnot. And this area here looks so cool too. That's a beautiful one. Here are the graphics for this one. 205 in the Hot Wheels Roadster. It's number 170 of 250 for the year. That's from here in the corner. And don't know what year this one's from. And I have another Porsche. This one's really beautiful. A nice metallic silver color. We do have that sunroof on the top. Windshield wipers are molded half on the glass and half on the uh, die cast. Do have nice mirrors on the side. Wow, the back end looks amazing. Carrera. Carrera name right there. And then we have those uh, vents. The exhaust right there. Two pipes. We do have a spot for the license plate. We have the, <clears throat> the brake lights. Really nice lights here on the back. <clears throat> that go come across all the way around. And the little white uh, reverse lights. Really cool. Nice chrome stripe on the blacked out wheels. These are really cool wheels too. Look at that. Isn't that nice? Two-door car. And this one is a left side driver. I have a little wing up here or something, or a little contour right there. We do have the water spritzers or water nozzles there on the hood. The Porsche badge in front. Check out the lights, they're so beautiful. Those are pretty well made the way they look. They look real. Oh, we are missing some colors here in the front. Some extra light colors and the grill down there. 1996 Porsche Carrera. Copyright 2018. Made in Malaysia. You can see the pipes right there on the back. Looks like the wheels are all the same size. It's beautiful. Porsche series with the red stripe, 205, 72 of 250 for this year. Really nice, really nice. And then I have this Scion, <coughs> pink Scion with a big number 86 on it, a little dusty. These these uh, bubble packs, bubble packs here attract everything, <laughs> every particle in the air. Made in Malaysia, Hot Wheels, Scion FRS, just like it says here, FRS.
There we go, we see the uh, gray wheels, 10 spokes. A beautiful enamel pink color with a white detail, stripes on the sides and that circle in white. Two pipes in the back, we do have a spot for license plate and the lights are not painted, they're just all covered over in pink. Front end, the grill's painted pink. The lights look amazing, the badge in the middle there looks good, the Scion badge. Very nice. This one is a right side driver. It has a steering wheel on here, on this side. Looks like we have a little antenna up there, a little, kind of a little wing there. And the windshield wipers are molded right on the glass. And the glass does have a smoke to it. It's kind of harder to see inside when it has a little smoke color or a little tint. So a little bit of tinted windows there. A really nice card on this one. Look at this. Beautiful car, hot wheels, lights are on. It's like a nighttime scene in the city. Looks really nice. Beautiful card. I love when they have these special cards. 505 in the series, and this one came uh, with a bunch of nice cars. The Ford Focus in red, the Nissan Skyline in white, the Volkswagen Golf is a green, and the Honda CRX is a black. A really nice series. I did find all of these, so lucky to have this whole set in my collection. Next up, a really cool Big Air Bel Air from the Rod Squad series. This is a nice hot rod. Big Air Bel Air with the jerry can in the back. Gold color with red interior. This one's kind of harder to find in the gold. Special edition, number 179 of 250. Rod Squad, one of 10. Very cool, Big Air, Bel Air. The lights are painted over in gold. And we do have that grill painted in gold as well. Then the silver bumper and plastic. And something showing on each side there. A little nice, uh, Hood there, Lucas Oil, Goodyear logos on the corners there, on each fender, I mean. Venden, Venden Vitusky sign there on each side, or his name. There are the uh, the light bar on top, right over that roller bar, rollover bar, really cool. We have a back spare tire in there on the back end, on the back area there. Two seats in the front, left side driver, no mirrors. No glass anywhere at all, without glass. Jerry can showing through on the back. The trunk there, all gold back here. Nice uh, darker uh, base on this one with the uh, fender showing through part of that base. And then inside, it's kind of tucked under, under there. Big uh, rugged tires on this one, but they're skinny. They're not that fat. The Big Air Bel Air, copyright 2019. And this may have been a new uh, model for 2020 when it first came out. I think the first one that was issued was a gray color, I think. A gray color, I've seen a red, I've seen a white one. I've seen a few colors of the uh, Big Air Bel Air. There's a green one out, a, a seafoam green one out now. And here's a beautiful Porsche. Wow, look at that. Isn't that cool? The Porsche 911 GT3 RS. So nice. Factory 500 HP, 10 of 10 in the series. You can collect 10 cars in this series. They're all awesome exotic cars. The GT3 RS. Look at all those cool cars. Well, I guess you don't consider all of these exotic. Some are muscle cars, some are exotic cars. Pretty cool, pretty cool series. A really nice Porsche in yellow with the black. So nice. GT3 RS, Porsche name all the way on the wing, all the way on top here. Mirrors on the side. The lights look amazing. All yellow on the back. And we do have the vents showing through here on the sides, a little smile there. <laughs> and the badge, really cool Porsche 911. Beautiful in the yellow GT3 RS. Yeah, and I have this one loose, but I have one that I wanted to keep carded. Such a cool car, and since I found two, these are hard to find. 
I went ahead and got that one. The Roger Dodger. Look at this. Roger Dodger in a gold color, metallic gold with brown tires and brown wheels. Gold stripe on the side here or around the edge. Steam for Steampunk. Hot Wheels Art Car Series, best for track, 8 of 10, 67 of 250 for that year. It has the number or the letter R on the roof. And you see all the little wheels designed on there, like the Steampunk. Steam, uh, steampunk. Uh, kind of style that they use. Very, very nice. Check out that engine. How can you see when you're driving with that engine? <laughs> Look at those uh, four pipes in the sides. The Roger Dodger, copyright 1970, and then again in 2015, Mattel. Probably when they changed the base of plastic. It used to come with a metal base, the older ones. Hot Wheels Art Cars. Very cool. Very nice. From what I hear, this is a very popular casting. Always sells well, the Roger Dodger. Now, I want to say that probably all Hot Wheels sell pretty well. Here's a custom Ford Ma Maverick in a light blue color. Black flames outlined by yellow and red or yellow and orange, like an orangey red color. Hot Wheels Flame Series and more flames up here, 9 of 10. Kind of like uh, obvious that it's a Flames Series car. All the flames on the hood, flames on the side. A really nice light blue. Kind of cool. I do have this Maverick in a black and probably a couple other colors. I know I have a yellow one. And look at that stripe, yellow stripe on the wheels. Really cool black front end there. Black spoiler, black bumper, black grill. And then we have the lights painted over in blue. And those mirrors all the way up here in front. Left side driver, we see the bucket seats, old school bucket seats in there. The shorter ones. Yellow tint on the windows. That black base. Custom Ford Maverick. Very cool. There you, there you see uh, what it looks like. It has all those colors there. The colors for the lights. And maybe a change of color for the uh, mirrors in the front. They do show the yellow tint on the window. And the flames. Very nice, a really cool Maverick. And this one, I also have it here in another color, Custom Ford Maverick. And this color is kind of hard to tell exactly what, what color is that. It's like a dark, deep, dark orange, I think. Metallic, dark orange. Is that called umber? I don't know. It's kind of like a dark orange. It has a red, kind of like a red in there, a little brown in there. And maybe that's how you make this color, red and brown. We do have the gold Hot Wheels logo, gold outlined white flames on this one on the side and white flames on the hood there. Same thing as the other one with the uh, mirrors all the way in the front, black interior. This one has different color here for the uh, handle. I think this one, the blue one also had the little handle in silver, yeah, and the little lock and the little lock there. But you can see the wheels were painted differently. They're same wheels, double spokes, but this one has all all the spokes in gold and the ring in gold. This one, black and yellow. So pretty cool. A couple of really cool Mavericks, both from the Hot Wheels Flame series. A couple of cool Mavericks, custom Ford Mavericks. Nice Fords right there. And check it out. Now we have a Merc, the 49 Merc. Looks to be the same color as that Maverick. Kind of like an orangey, red and brown, metallic color. Bright white interior, left side driver, bench seats in there. Flames everywhere, look at that. Flames, 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 a lot of flames. Hot Wheels Flame Series, one of 10. The 49 Merc, a chrome base in plastic, copyright 2003 on this one. And it is marked with the uh, 49 Merc down there. Very, very cool. Yellow glass on the front end here. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Look at this front end. Wow. Very, very cool. 
nice chrome plastic grill, chrome bumper, chrome bumper in the back as well. Very, very nice. Tinted glass in yellow, just like that other Maverick. And a lot of great details. When it comes to the graphics, a lot of details with the graphics. The lights should have been painted, but they gave us so many details with those uh, graphics, so many colors. I guess they couldn't afford to spend a little more and put paint those lights in, or maybe tamper them or gra you know put on those graphics on there for the lights. That would have been cool. But a really nice Merc. There's the uh, the uh, graphics on the card. You can see the pipes are on the side, just like they show them here in the chrome on the side there. And it has the mirrors that fold. No mirrors on this one. And again, the grill and the lights. The lights is what's missing. We do have the grill and chrome. Very cool. Glass is yellow, just as they show it there. Pretty cool. And then I have this one here, the Taima Taxi. This one has a lot of crazy things going on. Hot Wheels Metro Series 9 of 10, best for track. Special feature is shown on the back. Let's see. Oh, has an opening door to the side there. Taking the city by storm, one cool ride at a time. So this door does open. And that's pretty unusual for cars on the blue blue cards. Hardly ever have any moving parts. Only once in a while they have like a special feature. It's the Tima Taxi. Hot Wheels tuned taxi 24-7. Have a checkered flag back here. Kind of like a lightning bolt in white. Really cool graphics, I like that. That looks really nice. Isn't that a cool design there on the door and back here? Pretty neat. Again, on this one, all the glass is yellow. Yellow uh, see-through glass. We do have a little taxi. Taxi light that goes on the top. Let people know he's coming. Black grill on the front here. For the lights, they just let that plastic show through. Yellow plastic. You do have the yellow stripe on the side there. On the, uh, I'm sorry, on the side of the uh, wheels, which are blacked out. These are different wheels than the Maverick. The Maverick had the double spokes. The Time Taxi, copyright 2015, made in Malaysia. I think I've seen this one in five packs as well. And wow, look at that back end. Four pipes, two on each side, and then that strange looking bumper. Definitely looks like a race car taxi. <laughs> this one will get you there on time. Only one mirror on this side and then a little mirror all the way in front up here. A little strange combination of mirrors. And these fins here on the back. Don't know what those are for. Maybe to make them fly faster. Make the wind just keep going. I don't know. <laughs> Taking a guess there. Pretty cool taxi. And then... We have the 69 Camaro in blue, which I have a green one that I have loose. And now I don't remember. I think I have a blue one loose. I don't know. I'll have to check through my cases, but that'll take a long time. <laughs> Here we have a nice blue, blue, uh, all painted over in blue on the back end. A nice spot for license plates and lights, but there's no extra colors. And we do have that little contour wing back there, a little fin. Hot Wheels logo in silver back here. Really nice. Chrome wheels. Really cool five spokes. Black stripes. With some yellow. And I am missing a little bit of my black stripe right there. Camaro SS name there on the front fender. The Goodyear logo down here. We do have some silver trim here on the side. Silver trim all the way on the bottom there as well. A darker base. And we do have a spoiler, which is part of that base, right there in the front. And you can see the front is all blue. The grill is all blue. The SS painted over in blue. Super Sport. And all the lights on the bottom and the sides all painted over in blue. We do have the black and yellow or black and gold stripes. Really nice interior. Bucket seats. This These do have the taller bucket seats with the headrests. Left side driver. Windshield wipers on the glass there, looks like maybe, possibly. Kind of hard to tell with all the reflection and all the scuffs on this bubble. But it looks kind of smooth, maybe not, maybe not. 
We can see the roll, the top is rolled back. Got the top rolled down and then wait for a zone, baby. Song that goes like that somewhere. 69 Camaro. Beautiful car. Left side driver. So cool. Look at that. Nice graphics on this one. All the details are painted on this one on the on the graphics on the front. We needed that bumper in chrome there. We needed oh yeah, we needed all that. All that to make it look nice and finished. And there's a little something here in the front that we're not seeing there. Little parking lights with a little badge. It says 396, I think. 69 Camaro, there's nothing else on there. It doesn't say 396, but this is from the Hot Wheels Roadster series. Three of five, beautiful Camaro. And wow, really nice. Really nice uh, graphics on this one. Cool stripes indeed. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed hanging out with me today, checking out some of my Carter collection, uh, Hot Wheels Carter collection, Hot Wheels leading the way, and also Hot Wheels. It's not the same without the flame, the Hot Wheels flame. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video.